I'm going to go off script here for just a minute and talk about outside counsel. In many of the cyber incidents we respond to, companies hire outside counsel, legal counsel, to protect their interests. Uh, our ask of all of you on this call today would be to work with your outside counsel now in anticipation of a cyber incident occurring and to lower the barriers with outside counsel to bring the FBI in sooner than later. We found from our experience that companies who are willing to have those proactive conversations with outside counsel today uh, better position themselves for a complete team engagement at the moment of an unfortunate compromise. We obviously know that targeted entities risk negative publicity if they disclose being impacted by a cyber incident. As a result, incidents are often addressed by the entity discreetly and are never reported to the public or to law enforcement. But when organizations choose to keep quiet, that threat information stops at that organization and it doesn't go anywhere and it doesn't warn anyone else. So the threat actors are able to continue to use the same methods to victimize someone else. When organizations report, our response to the incident allows us to collect information so we can find those responsible, work with our domestic and international partners to disrupt the activity and hold them accountable, and equally important, so we can share that information to warn others. Each reported incident can provide additional clues necessary to pursue our cyber adversaries. Let me give you some basic data. In a best case scenario, we in the United States government, that's the FBI, NSA, CISA, know about less than 25% of all computer intrusions in this country. In 2020, the year 2020, Ransomware incidents rose by 20%, but ransoms paid rose by 225%. As we look at the most current data we have in the calendar year 2021, the frequency of ransomware attacks is increasing again, and there's another 20% increase on reported ransoms paid. So the problem is growing in severity.